Hello and welcome to my series on how to make a 3D game in Unity. In this tutorial series, we will make a game similar to The Legends of Zelda Breath of the Wild. We will be importing this cool knight as the main character for our game. He comes with three different renderings for you to choose from and animations for us to apply. We also will be using these orcs for our AI. These also come with three different renderings and their own animations. Our game will also include an inventory, dynamic camera, and open world scenery. Without further ado, let's get started. So we have here our Unity Hub. We're going to start a new project. Make sure you have 3D selected. And we'll call this 3D Tutorial. After that, press create and it'll open the unity editor so to start off let's organize ourselves a little bit let's create a folder for our art and let's create another one for our scripts and lastly we'll create a folder for our prefabs After that, we'll go to the top and we'll hit the tab for the Asset Store. It'll connect us right to the Unity Asset Store. And we're looking for 3D. There it is, 3D characters. And right here is the page we want to go to, Dungeon Mason. Uh, it's free despite what that said right there. This is the page of the artist who made these. We'll just sort it out by price because we want the free one and right here is what we want RPG Hero PBR HP Polyart. And we'll go ahead and download. And while it's downloading I'll explain a little bit of why I chose these uh, in addition to having a, a full set of animations attached to it makes it easier for us. Uh, I like the idea that it had three different renderings to it so that if you wanted to create let's say a mobile game you could use the uh, less detailed knight on all the way to the left and if you want a more detailed game you can use the one in the middle. Uh, I think right now I'm gonna go with one all the way to the right because I wanted to give it a little more retro look with a little bit of detail but it's you know I'm just showing you how to make the game it's really your world to create at the end of the day you you choose how you want this to be okay it's decrypting right now it should be we should get the import button in a second all right there we go we'll just we'll hit import and we'll get the show on the road Alright, here are all the files we are importing with our character. It's just going to be a second. There it is. And now we have a folder for our RPG Hero. Here are all the things that came with our package. Here are all the separate animations. Here's the full animator for us to use. We'll be going into that later. We have a list of materials meshes, uh, prefabs, uh, scenes, and all this other stuff. So thank you for watching. Like my video, subscribe to my channel, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and support me on Patreon. All links in the description below. See you next time.